How much is this bit? Here we have the elusive 14 year old. Will you stop? Doing dishes. Yeah. Something never seen occurring naturally in the wild. That has soap on the inside of it. <laughs> Tonight, we hang the shelves. Mommy got a quarter inch bit. And oh, good. I'm very pleased. I don't know how much you had to pay for that. And three eighths inch plugs. So I did not score on all fronts. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Make sure those are exactly the same. What? What's happening what here? Doing? Yeah, but put it in the exact same spot. Oh, no. What? <laughs> They're going to be plugged and painted. You're never going to see them. Please, please. They're going to be plugged and painted. Okay, they might get plugged and painted. They might not. I, I mean, they'll get painted. <laughs> please, please, please drill this one. Drill this one in the exact... Yes, yes, yes. Those are the ones that match. Now drill them in the exact same spot, please. These don't match. Yes, right? they do. They're close enough. None of them match. It's all out of old barnwood. This whole house. Then why does the holes have to match? Because. Because we got some wood. We're going to make a dresser out of it. We're not making a dresser. <laughs> Tell us what kind of um, drill bit you got there. You like it? Really? Is it for ceramic? It says it is. It says it's multi purpose, high impact, tough. All right. All in one. It says on the back for tile, concrete. So. Hopefully, it will go through. Those aren't the same, are they? It won't matter. Yeah. Good. The no ceramic tile. Because it's plugs, it's going to be painted. But I got the wrong size plugs. Well. Could you take a three eighths inch drill bit and just go rear? I might, but right now. And then they'll fit. That's, we don't have that counter bit like Zeb has. Oh my goodness. Why do we have to fight all the time? Can't we all just get along? The pizza oven has proven to be our main source of heat since the fireplace has no damper. Mm. Oh my goodness. He's not doing anything to you, you wretched old man. <laughs> so we drilled one through the front and we're drilling one at an angle. Uh oh. We think. There we go. Through the top to anchor them in. Oh my, let's capture another shot of rare footage. <laughs> the 14 year old sweeps. Excellent. Maybe you'll remember this nice barn wood that I sanded and left with a live edge. And we're about to put it up here with these corbels that I traced in another video. Ouch. And that's gonna be my shelves. Okay, we've got it marked. Are you ready? Yes, <laughs> but you should know. <laughs> what should I know? Did not crack the top. All right, we still got to do it. I mean, you gonna hold this thing? so you drill your hole in your corbel, it's not straight, and then you drill your hole through the corbel into the tile, 
and I've got to hold it so I can't hold the video camera too. All right, so we decided to take it out and look at it, and so he says it's doing well. It's right here if you can't see on YouTube. What is that? It's the hole. <laughs> you can see the hole. <laughs> is it sheetrock behind it? It is, isn't it? Okay. So now we're just going to try to drill through. Oh, that was scary. Okay, great. Phew. There's lots of smoke and there's lots of dust, but we made it through and it did not crack the this, tile. This is a good bit. Okay, good I don't bit. Know how much Where, you paid for it. I don't either. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but I got it at Home Depot. It's called a multi purpose impact tough. It says metal tough on it. You think you're gonna have to have those? What's wrong? What's wrong? Nothing. Thank Why are you making that face like I screwed something up? <laughs> <laughs> yes, screw it up. is. So we've hit a snag because, of course, you can't put these screw anchors through that tile. And Brad pointed out something to me. This is five eighths. This is three eighths. This is one quarter. So. Don't send mommy to the store. Okay, show how you did that since I screwed it up. All right, so I, I bought a one-fourth bit and a what? Three-eighths plug. So, well, this all going to work out fine. I have a graded or graduated bit, and it has different sizes on it, and I'll just go down to three-eighths. And we'll do a test run on this. Where'd you get that bit? Harbor Freight. Harbor Freight. They're okay. They're okay. Okay. And it's okay that the plug is a different color wood because I'm painting them. You'll shave that off. I'm gonna go a little bit. I don't know, it might be about right. Once I beat it in there. How do you shave it off? Sander. Oh, okay. I love how our crackers and cheese is right next to our, um, <laughs> our See, work. Yeah. You okay with that? Uh, that went a little too far, I think, but I can put a little putty in it. <laughs> we putty everything. We found some screw plugs that will work. Putting those in. So, the screw head's too big. It won't matter, well, it won't matter on the top. And then maybe we can get some smaller ones for the fronts. Fine for the top. Work. Mm. There. Now I'm going to put pressure on all these. Alright. Drill through the top. Okay. Okay. Through the bottom. Drill through the bottom. Okay, we did it and nothing cracked or broke. That's fantastic. A little tighter. Perfect. A little tighter. You think it has room to push the plug in there with that screw on bottom? You sand it off. Oh, okay. Zeb has a tiny little saw. Maybe Zeb, give me a saw. Zeb, can you please watch my YouTube channel and give me a saw? 
<laughs> Shameless plugs, Zeb and Jamie Ray at Jamie Ray Vintage. I love them, and this is where I got this idea. And um, so, show that off, Zebul yeah. Zebulon. I really don't know what his name is. That looks fantastic, baby. Right. Fantastic. Now we'll do the other one. One thing I want to note is it is important when you're drilling the um, go through the angle with the corbel up here so you make sure you get the right angle into the... <laughs> Not with that, but make sure you get the right angle into the tile. So that's um, one, and we have three to go. You're being crazy. Rather than just measuring where the next one should go, we are leveling it because everything in our old house is wonky. Except for this tile line. It's perfect. Yes, the tile line is close to perfect because you're... The professional tile person uh -huh. who put that in. Mm. It was me. She was a good cook. <laughs> is that going to end?